Good morning, my YouTubers, my Tubies, Teletubbies, and TikTokers. Today is September 20th, Tuesday. I was just thinking today I have to get my um, a new refrigerator. I'm getting a new refrigerator today. Isn't that exciting? Yay! Okay, my darlings, I haven't even had a full cup of coffee yet. And I know it's late. What time is it? That's because I'm waiting for my new refrigerator. So I took a uh, vacation day today. Uh, first question. What did Jesus say the disciples should do at someone's home if they were not welcome? You can find that at Matthew chapter 10, verse 14. One, two, three. Shake the dust off their feet. Keep on trucking, baby. <laughs> you, can, yeah. you can hear in the morning. <laughs> That's funny. My voice is not all that great. <clears throat> Excuse me. In the morning. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> let me get myself together here. Hold on. Let me take a sip of coffee. Okay. Your next question how many sons did Noah have? You can find that at Genesis chapter 6, verse 10. One, two, three. He had three sons. He had Shem, Ham, and Japheth. Now, my beautiful, beautiful people, it's time for your power thought for the day. Today, we're going to focus on how sometimes life can be very, very overwhelming. Unemployment is on the rise. Well, actually, not here in New York. Unemployment is uh, not really because they have so many jobs available. People don't want to work. They're making too much money on social media. They don't feel the need to work. But anyway, a lot of places, unemployment is on the rise and diseases for which there is no treatment and unseen circumstances Yes, that can be very, very overwhelming. And all of it can make you feel totally helpless at times. What do you do <clears throat> when you're feeling help hopeless and helpless when you are faced with difficult situations? Ask yourself, what do you do? I know what I do. I pray and I trust. Now, the people in the Bible, they discovered the power of prayer and they used it. Prayer was like oxygen to them. That was their secret to a happy life. People are saved from their powerlessness through the power and strength of prayer and Jesus Christ. Some scriptures that I'd like for you to read to help build you up further. Acts chapter 5 verse 39. Philippians chapter 4 verse 13. Philippians chapter 4 verse 6 and 7. Isaiah chapter 40, verse 31, and Isaiah chapter 26, verse 3. And if I already said this, then I guess it needed to be said or spoken again. Don't forget to see your prayer as oxygen, darling. And believe me when I tell you, it really, really works. I'm like, yes. Anyway, I love you very much, and I want you to have an amazing day. Today is going to be a good day. Every morning that you wake up, I want you to put that out there. Just get up out of the bed and say, it's going to be a great day. Today is going to be a good day. And keep in mind, as always, Jehovah loves you. Jesus Christ loves you. And guess what? So do I. Bye, darling.